Welcome back, everybody. Back in the kitchen with Michelle from Lamer's Dairy. They're celebrating 100 years uh, right in the Appleton area, the, the big red barn. You can't miss it. Stop in, gift store, you can get ice cream and pick up some wonderful milk, heavy cream. And we were just talking about your great lemonade, too. Oh, it's delicious. Oh, we yeah. have regular and raspberry lemonade. It's Ann's favorite. Ann yeah, can't get enough delicious. of the lemonade. My son, either. He's <laughs> drinking it all the time. It's so hot out. Lemonade is just perfect, uh, especially this week. So we are going to cool you off with a cool, refreshing cucumber soup. And if you've never had a cold soup, don't think, you, trust us on this one. It's fantastic, especially it when it's hot outside. Um, it, you know, give it a try. They're wonderful, and I love cucumbers. So Yeah, and it has fresh cucumbers and, and whole milk, really healthy for you. And the cucumbers help with inflammation and water retention, so it's a great summer thing. Mm. Okay. So, so what we're starting out with is I, I did this ahead because it takes 10 minutes. We have two cups of veggie stock and we have um, three leeks that have been cleaned. This is what a leek looks if, like if um, your audience isn't familiar with them. It's in the onion family. It's got a mild, milder flavor. But it takes a lot of cleaning. You only use this amount, cut off the top, split it open, wash, 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 because okay. the sand loves the leeks. But it's, there's nothing like the flavor of it. It's really delicious. Right, so this is what it's the part that you're going to use, and you're going to want to slice it thinly and dr and put it into the two cups of veggie stock and cook it for about 10 minutes till it's soft. Okay. Then we're going to add two. No butter, no oil, nothing. No, that's what it's makes great. it eat super help I healthy. I love it. Okay. Then we're going to, we don't even need to heat it up because we're going to make a cold soup. Okay. So we're going to add the two cups of Lamer's whole milk. Okay. I've got a measuring cup right here. Yeah. And that's our milk in glass bottles, which is just increasingly more popular. Everybody loves it and the taste is, keeps it colder in the summer, which is nice on your table. I just think it looks cool too and like you say there's a whole big thing with plastics and people are really okay. into glass and recycling and it's, yeah, it's, it's a great wonderful. thing. wonderful. Okay. So then what we're going to do is we need six cucumbers and this is what we're going to start with. We, I, I understand you like English cucumbers too. I do. Which is I the do. seedless. That's, uh -huh. This is actually in English. It's a seedless. It's a little bit different. It's quite long. But we're basically going to peel this, split it and take out the seeds. Okay. So we're going to add that to our um, mixture here and okay. what's really great is that doesn't have to be, nothing has to be hot. You know, you, if you want to do the leeks in the morning before the, your day gets off and gets hot, you can do that and just stick it in your fridge and then resume um, when you come home. Perfect. Okay. So then what we're going to do is we are going to then add, also we have a tablespoon of lemon juice. Okay. Oh. Is right over here. There. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. And that goes right in there with the cubes. Um, that's right. Okay. And um, actually, um, we're going to puree it first. And, okay. But that doesn't. It doesn't matter. It actually okay. is nice for the flavor. So we're going to puree it in batches. Okay. So um, we'll load up our blender here. We will. And that's why it's really important to have it cold because you don't want the whole looks blending. If you ever put hot liquid in a blender, you'll never do it again. That's uh, right. It just uh, have to be real careful with that. Yeah, the team, the steam expands mm -hmm. and then uh, it can blow the lid off. Yes. And, and I've had that happen. <laughs> Not fun to clean up for yeah. sure. And it can be a little dangerous too. So right. okay. So make sure it's all nice and cold. Right. And we have plenty of liquid in there. Mm -hmm. How chunky do you want it? It's up to you. That's what's really nice. And it, it is a little bit, of, because it's a, a cold preparation, it's going to stay a little bit chunky. But you can see how fast this is. So mm -hmm. we'll just... We'll you, just keep doing it in batches. Right, And right. then let's, we've got some over here. And show us how you kind of garnish it up and make it look extra special. That What I like to do is I'm going to take your famous English cucumber and I'm just going to do a little decoration on the for the edges. And what I'm going to do too is you can put a little bit of Greek yogurt. So once we have this, um, the pureed bit too, Amy, you can go ahead. Oh, I need a yep. knife. Yep. You should grab yep. one of your knives. Yep. You betcha. You can add the dill and the chives. So do you just want this with some slices? Pepper. Yes. Okay. All right. And then so salt and pepper to this? Uh, yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. so a little salt and pepper. I was like wondering, what is this? Is like, <laughs> this is our kosher salt. I love it. Yeah. I love it. And then sure and uh, the yogurt goes in here or go no, around the top? No, actually I'm going to do that for our garnish. Okay. So what we do is we've used that little cannellini knife. You can put that on top, put a little spoonful Ready. of this. And actually for the soup, to finish the soup, you can add the chives and the dill. And we already add the lemon juice. So we're good with dollop that. dollop of yogurt. Yeah. Thanks, there Karen. Or I'm Michelle, I should say. Uh, Michelle from Lamer's Dairy. Recipes are on our website.